we saw a break in the activity for our day yesterday. Temperatures out remain cold and unfortunately we're seeing the snow showers return as we start off our day. So as we get that look across the Ohio County traffic cams, the good news though, anything we're really seeing the way of snow showers at this point is becoming relatively light. So more so light snow showers and some flurries and we're still noticing our roads actually in fairly good condition this morning. You can see traffic like across I-470 flowing smoothly. So road crews have been doing a fantastic job at keeping roads clear, but just know that road temperatures themselves are still well below freezing. So spots like I-70, State Route 2, Route 7, they're in fairly good condition this morning, but any back roads likely will have snow on them. So my rule of thumb is, is when temperatures are below freezing and you see water on the roads, likely expected to be ice. And that's really going to be the case this morning as well. In terms of winter alerts, we still have a winter weather advisory in effect for Wetzel and Tyler County. That's until 10 a.m. this morning. Since we still could see a few more snow showers that roll on through, especially once we head towards sunrise and a little bit later. So right now, most of us just dealing with some flurries, but a few more snow showers will try to push on in, especially as we head towards that 7, 8 a.m. time frame. The past date, the heavier the, so the snow showers themselves push into Pennsylvania. And we'll just be left with a couple of flurries as we continue through the morning. But by 10 a.m. though, snow showers and flurries out of the area, and even a good chance that we're going to see our clouds try to clear on out. Even could see a few extra pockets of sunshine, especially by the time we get to that 3 to 4 p.m. time frame. Just know, unfortunately, even with sunshine, temperatures are still going to feel very cold throughout the day today. And we're seeing that as we start the morning. It's about 15 here in Wheeling with our warm spots of 17 in Moundsville and New Martinsville, but a very chilly 12 degrees in Caddis. So give your car a couple extra minutes to warm up into frost and definitely make sure you layer up as you step out the door this morning since temperatures themselves won't even get out of the likely out of the teens. Most of us should max out somewhere between 16 and 19 this afternoon, but our field like temperatures likely feeling like the single digits all throughout the day today and even colder and becoming very frigid overnight tonight. So temperatures overnight tonight, this is going to be, I would give that the 2 to 6 a.m. time frame tomorrow morning. Everyone likely in the single digits. So 7 degrees up into Chester, Moundsville and New Martinsville, but as cold as a very frigid 2 degrees on over into Millersburg. Because of that, we do have a wind chill advisory that goes in effect at 10 p.m. this evening until noon tomorrow. This means our feels like temperatures could feel as cold as negative 15 degrees. So if you're outside, even for a short period of time, just walk into your car. Make sure you bundle up in layers. Make sure you cover any bare exposed skin because you could easily develop frostbite in just about 30 to 40 minutes. So especially extended periods of time, make sure you bundle up and cover up all throughout the day tomorrow. So tomorrow, though, we do see this return of sunshine. Temperatures get back into the 20s. But we see our next system roll on through for the end of the week, returning snow showers Thursday and Friday. Could see some light accumulations with that. Then 18, straight snow shower for our day on Saturday before we're back to sunshine. 25 on Sunday and 38, mostly sunny for our day on Monday.